the word of God, we're going to hear from God. But first, we're going to just give him everything that we have. And then so whatever that looks like for you is okay. There isn't a set way to do it. You can quietly stand and, and sing and, and listen along and just and, and just have those those feelings out on your heart. Or you can clap your hands, amen? You could get loud and do a little dance. You can lift your hands. We're okay with all of that, amen? Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Hallelujah.
worship God. Hallelujah. John chapter 8. Um, some people are asking Jesus about who he is. Basically. And he's trying to explain who he is. And in verse 34, he says this. Jesus replied, Very truly I tell you, everyone who sins is a slave to sin. So I read that and I'm like, okay. <laughs> now a slave has no permanent place in the family, but a son belongs to it forever. See, us mothers know it doesn't matter what our kids, there's nothing they could do, right? So if the son sets you free, Amen. you will be free indeed. One more time, if you didn't hear the first time. Everyone who sins is a slave to sin. Now a slave has no permanent place in the family, but a son belongs to it forever. So if the son sets you free, you will be free in you. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! When you came in this morning, you had one of these in your bulletin. I want to give you a few moments as I'm singing this song, as we're worshiping, to think about what you're thankful for this morning. Just think about it. We've been celebrating during worship grace and freedom. So think about what you're thankful for. Write that down for me. And anytime during the song, just feel free. Just come right out. I'm going to put mine on. Can we do that together? Can we worship a little differently this morning? Praise God. There's no rush. We're going to sing this song. Just let God, just have a moment with God. Amen? Have a moment with God and show Him your, your thankfulness. Show Him your appreciation. Hallelujah. We worship you, God.